It is now a situation of red alert. We have a red alert between the Hagofell and the Swartzengi on the map, latest map, by the Icelandic Meteorological Office. This is the situation first before that. Now we have the red alert in place. That is an imminent eruption possible. And I will show you the map that I think actually the eruption will happen. This is my estimate based on the analysis of the uh, shape of the fault lines and the stress relief in that area. I think this will be north of the Hagofell, between the Hagofell and Sundunka. Most of the flow will be toward the south and uh, northeast, and slightly also toward the uh, north. This diagram shows the bulging of the ground at the Eld Warp. Every time we reach that top, it, uh, we had an eruption. This is the Swartzengi one now, and the next one is a skipat stick uh, lava field to the west of the Swartzengi. As you can see, we have now passed the threshold for eruption. We can see big earthquake forming at the depth of the four and a half kilometers. And then from there, we are seeing that it is rising toward the surface, almost touching the surface. The big ones will arrive in a few hours to days to the surface. That means eruption happened. The pattern of the earthquake between the Grindavik and the Swartzengi Blue Lagoon looks almost like this uh, horn of a Viking helmet. It's uh, one of those ironies of the situation. <laughs> and uh, the eruption is very close to the surface. We can see that here, south direction. And as I mentioned, I believe this is the shape of the dike you are seeing. This is a fault line filled with the magma forming what we call as a dike. Inside the grab and hag hagofell, it will erupt. This is what, uh, what I'm uh, guessing this will happen and uh, based on the analysis of the stress levels. And this is again the new alert map I've superimposed on that. The new eruption feature that I think will erupt the blue line and the direction of the flow of the lava. And this is the close-up of that based on the Google Earth map. You can see that's the Graben and this is where the eruption happens. Swartzengi will be protected by the wall and the hill of Thorbjorn which are around it, I don't think there is a risk there for the Swartzengi or the Blue Lagoon.